Our oceans, lakes and rivers are precious. We are at a turning point for our oceans. The next 10 years represent a critical opportunity to accelerate international efforts and achieve the goal of sustainable fisheries and aquaculture. That's why this year's State of World Fisheries and Aquaculture report is focused on sustainability in action. The report highlights major trends in global fisheries and aquaculture and also scans the horizon for new and emerging strategies to better manage aquatic resources sustainably into the future. The sector is at the core of Sustainable Development Goal 14, which calls for the conservation and sustainable use of the oceans, seas and marine resources. Progress is being achieved, but challenges remain. While 65.8% of fish stocks are harvested sustainably, the remaining 34.2% are overfished. Fisheries management is therefore more crucial than ever. Totaling 179 million tonnes, fisheries alone reached 96.4 million tonnes, while aquaculture production reached 82.1 million tonnes, or even more if you include aquatic algae. This is good news for the billions of people who rely on fish as a primary source of protein, and the millions who earn their livelihood working in fisheries and aquaculture. Women play an important role in this labour force, especially in the post-harvest sector. Beyond the nutrition and employment benefits, fish has also become one of the most traded commodities in the world in recent decades, with developing countries taking on an increasingly important role in this arena. As such, fisheries and aquaculture have an indispensable function in society that we simply cannot take for granted. The world must work together to ensure that the generations to come can continue to access this vital source of nutrition and employment, especially as the population continues to grow and global production continues to intensify.